The completed report for the Commission of Inquiry into the Lindo Creek Massacre recommends, among other things, that compensation be given to the families of the eight murdered minors who were slaughtered sometime between June 12, 2008 and June 24, 2008. Justice Donald Trotman, who headed the COI, announced this at State House today, telling reporters that the compensation to the families is necessary since they would have faced economic challenges since the death of their loved ones. As many of the families have suffered financially from the deaths of their um, husbands or fathers uh, who were at the time supporting them. They were dependent and now that they have gone there is no support, economic and financial support and so we feel that compensation should be given them. Meanwhile, President Granger, who ordered the commission earlier this year, says that the intention of his government is for Guyanese to live in a society without brutality, as the administration will continue to look into the causes of various killings, which occurred in what he says was the era of troubles. It was a time of arbitrary arrests, of disappearances, and of torture of young men, of the surge in armed robberies, narco trafficking, and gun running. During that first deadly decade, there were 1,370 murders and 7,865 armed robberies. That decade of troubles he mentioned ended in the late 2000s. However, government's approach to the first of several inquiries was much criticized by the opposition, which was in government at that time. The BBB felt that the Lindo Creek Massacre shouldn't have been the first such COI. Now that the COI report has been submitted, it is up to President Granger to implement the recommendations which he sees fit. The minors, Cecil Arochium, Dax Arochium, Compton Spears, Horace Drakes, Clifton Wong, Lancelot Lee, Bonnie Harry and Nigel Torres were shot and killed and their bodies burnt at the Upper Burbies River Mining Camp, which was operated by Leonard Arochium. The Lindo Creek killings followed two other massacres in 2008 at Lusignan and Bartico. Shemuel Fanfare, The Evening News.